In this series, I will be challenging a fellow YouTuber to a GOAT format duel. But this won't be just any GOAT format duel. Each player will spin a wheel that will determine how the decks can be built using only GOAT format era cards. These restrictions range from certain packs to open, to only allowing the use of common cards, and many more. After each player builds a deck, we duel. Who will be the wheeled goat of Yugi Tube? You'll just have to watch the series to find out. All right, guys, we're back with episode two of Wheeled Goat versus Simo, and this one has high stakes because the winner has to stop wood cutting for 24 hours in RuneScape. I'm trying to catch up to him. I'm only level 93 at the moment, probably higher by the time you see this, but trying to catch up to him and win the battle to 99. But not important if you're a Yu-Gi-Oh viewer. So I have 20. This is 20 options on the wheel this time. So if you made a suggestion, I haven't actually posted the first video yet. So that will be implemented probably in episode three three but i added a bunch of different new stuff some is specific as you guys can see i did some stuff like use um water attribute only not any attribute water attribute so i did stuff like that or i did use any attribute so if you get lucky you can have one that's more generic and you have more options or if you get unlucky you might have to use something super specific so 20 options on the wheel let's spin and see what we have to make our deck out of this time come on baby give us something good Give us something fun, at least. Like, something fun. Okay, using only... I hate how it cuts off so you don't know what you're getting. Okay, what is it? Oh, only one level of monster. Okay, fairly generic. So I, I, I could pick one, you know, probably not anything above one, two, three, or four, because then it'd be, you, know, you have to tribute stuff. And I don't even know how that would work. I guess you could do some special summoning stuff, but a lot of it doesn't really special summon that, you know, in GOAT format. So I guess we'll find out. Any one level of monster from GOAT format, this should be pretty interesting. I think if we do, like, level fours, it'll probably be pretty easy. Well, 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 it looks like Mr. Ruxin34 wants a GOAT rematch after his performance in the arena. I'll happily grant it to him. We can play by his terms. Let's spin the wheel and see what our restriction is going to be for our deck. Please be something good. Please be something good. Please be something good. Deck using only level two monsters. Oh, this is not going to go well. Oh my God. I actually built this deck on stream on Twitch. Probably going to be doing that on Mondays for the series. So if you want to go follow me on Twitch, go follow twitch.tv slash ruxin34. We'll be doing Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel stuff on Monday, most likely. So go give me a follow there if you want to help build the decks in the future. This is what we came up with. With level four, you can pretty much do a lot of insane things. I might have to implement some restrictions like spells and traps in the future, you know, just so you can't just use generically good go format spells and traps every time. Time. But this time we're able to use a lot of awesome stuff. The only things you can't use are based on go for my ban list. And of course, Master Duel doesn't like to craft some certain things. So I couldn't craft some of the crazy cards. Like uh, I think it was Duo. Delinquo Duo, thank goodness. That doesn't, that's not even fun. So this is what we were able to come up with. We have three Mystic Tomatoes. We have a Kaiku, the Ghost Destroyer. It's essentially a Gravekeeper deck with three Spy, three Guard, a couple of Spear Soldier, a couple of Assailant. Then we have some good stuff like Breaker. We have a uh, Tribe Infecting, DD Warrior Lady, and Tsukiyomi. You have a bunch of power stuff we of course have stuff to go grab necro valley which this is was actually legal back then not legal in master duel right now but uh that's why we have to do unlimited three necro valleys and just a bunch of crazy stuff a lot of uh chainable spell and traps this one's not but for the most part everything here is chainable so a lot it's not going to get popped really easily with like a mystical space typhoon dust tornado heavy storm anything like that so overall i think the deck is really really strong it was strong last week and we still lost so i'm going to try to not make any misplays this time um bring the right deck to the duel so a lot of things i gotta check off that to not do that i did last week this is big because i gotta beat simo we gotta get that advantage in wood cutting and runescape ah <laughs> Fools! You thought you were going to get a good game of Yu-Gi-Oh against Ruxin, but behold, the creation of the Instrument of Destruction and Ruxin's Demise. Level 2 Mill Stall! This deck is so bad. Uh, so basically, if you look at the level 2 pool that is prior to the release of what is it, Cybernetic Revolution, because it's just Lost Millennium for the cutoff for GOAT format, there's not many good level two monsters. The best ones are basically the ones that you are looking at here. And the most notable are Medusa Worm plus Blade Rabbit, which form the makings of a sort of control-ish style of deck, a la Clown Control, right? Blade Rabbit's basically Clown Control in a different suit. So I figured it makes the most sense for us to go the uh, control approach, but we sort of need like a win condition, and that's where the Needle Worms come in. So we can mill Ruxin out while we have established control of the field. We have Triple Needle Worm plus Morphing Jar plus Card Destruction. So theoretically, that's like 25 cards we could get out of him. Plus with three Book of Moon, we can like reset the Needle Worm, and Needle Worm serves a dual purpose of like getting rid of like his heavy storm his out to all of our stall cards like stumbling and wall revealing light and you know just level limit gravity bind anything that we have access to so 
I think this is like sort of okay. I don't know how well it's going to fare depending on what he spun. I think it's going to be very dependent on how much back row removal he has. If he doesn't have a lot of back row removal, I think we win this 2-0 easily. But if he does have back row removal, it might be a tough time. These spell shields and solemn judgments might have to put in a lot of work. Welcome back to the Wheeled Goat. We have the one, the only, Simo. And of course, we have to reference Oxen Series here. And then we also have to reference the fact that the winner of this... <laughs> Cannot be wood cutting on old school RuneScape for 24 hours. That's the most important part about this video. I stay. He's you're level 96 right now, right? Sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm level 96. Oh, right you now. better be 96. <laughs> okay, I'm 94, so I'm way behind. So I really need to win this because so I have a 24 hour period of pure unadulterated comeback. So 24 hours of no wood cutting is big because then the other person gets 24 hours where they get to like get ahead while the other person isn't cutting at all. So that actually matters even more than people might think. It's like a double down, basically. Exactly. So exactly. I, I either get that 24 hours closer or you get 24 hours farther ahead. So, mm -hmm. but honestly, it's a win win because if I have to stop wood cutting, that's a good thing for me. So <laughs> uh, I've been wood cutting entirely too much. Let's get into this. This is. Who cares about Yu-Gi-Oh? It's all about wood cutting. It Let's is, go. All this, literally the only reason we're here is because of that. For our side. Yeah, event. I made this series just so I could play Simo and something. <laughs> All right, so I won the coin toss. So I want to go first, so I'm going to go second. So you can pass it to me and I can get the card. I'm not even in the thing. Uh, <laughs> okay. Oh, it's just spinning. Oh, no. They know. They're like, you're on the wrong game. This ain't going to work. Evidently. I can't even get out of here. Come this on, buddy. Is, this is so weird. All right, no response from the game server. Woo! I guess I don't technically win that coin toss. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Ruxin, how are you feeling about your, your episode today? How are you feeling about your cards? Well, I was feeling better when I was going first. Now, not so good. <laughs> I will say, I'll tell you, I played a few ranked games with my GOAT deck, so just Why? know that. Why did you do that? <laughs> Except some, some cards had to be taken out because, you know, standard rules and stuff. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. I'm going to go ahead and set a card. I'm going to set another Naturally. Card. This is go format. And uh, you know what? Let's just start no. by making your life miserable. I'm going to activate level limit area. B. Oh, the rhyme sound rule has been broken already. Oh, I should have seen this coming. Okay. I'm sorry, Rhyme. I did my best to this try to keep it out. This may or may not give you some insight into what I have uh, cooked up for you today. Oh, boy. If you're playing clowns after I played clowns, <laughs> I'm going to be upset. Okay? I'm just throwing that out there. Do you want to give them context to what we were talking about before we started recording? <laughs> yeah, I was talking about how the Rhyme Style Rule from episode one and how I will not play these cards. And I was I, I was like, there's a 90% chance he probably has them in his deck. <laughs> um, oh, my gosh. To so, be fair, you didn't tell me that until just before we started recording. Hey, recorded, look, it's so. not a rule for the guests, okay? So it's you fair, guys are fair. you're not required to follow it. It's just a it's an optional rule that I have imposed upon myself. I will also let you know, based off of the, the restriction I had for my deck, there is a legitimate reason I chose to play this. So you will find out shortly. The question is, is, can I leave this thing up? And I think the answer is no. Let's just get rid of it right away. Let's Have get the it out MST. of here. MST, okay. Yeah, let, right. let's get it out of here. I can't I can't be switching to defense constantly. That's going to be obnoxious. I'm going in. Gravekeeper Spear Soldier. What are you up to? Okay, I'm just going to do a little piercing damage if you'll allow it. I guess we'll find out. See, you think that I would allow you to get some piercing damage in, but uh, you activated the real trap no! card, Wall of Revealing Light. You know what? I'm going to pay 3000 I'm feeling You're comfortable. You're also playing Wall of Revealing Light? <laughs> oh, my God. There will You're be no evil. attacking today, Ruxin. <laughs> you are literally... You want a woodcut, don't you? You really want a yeah, woodcut. of course. I want to make sure you don't get to woodcut. That's the whole point of this. All right, I'm going to set a card. I mean, I have a feeling that this is some sort of stupid flip monster. I, Why or, would you or, think that it's a stupid flip monster? Why on earth would you think Maybe because we're playing like, Go Format. This was my mistake making a Go Format series. Well, I can let you know it's not a flip monster, but it does have an effect when it's flipped. It's my Medusa Worm. <laughs> it does have an effect when it's flipped. Great. <laughs> awesome. Uh, and then, you know what? I'm going to get in for 500. I'm not afraid of your back row. You like, are, you are, this is obnoxious. What are you going to have? What are you going to soccer Retsu arm? Yeah, that's what I thought. You're not going to soccer Retsu arm and Medusa uh, arm. All right, we're going to activate uh, Medusa arm. We're going to flip it back down. Yeah, 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 whatever. And then we're going to go ahead and uh, let's just set another one. How about that? And, no. Uh, we'll pass it back. We'll pass it back. No. 
Unbelievable. What's wrong, Ruxin? What's wrong? Oh, uh, this is depressing. Okay, well. <laughs> Fortunately for me, I had two outs for okay, this. Okay, okay, all right. Because uh, I had an inkling that if I'm not playing that card, there's a good chance that somebody else would be. So I, I was prepared to at least have some back row. Okay. All right. I uh, would like you to meet my second Gravekeeper Spear Soldier. Wow, you have a second Grave Speaker Spear Soldier. Okay, sure. Uh, let's uh, let's just let's just get to battle here. Let's uh, let's let's do some piercing on this Medusa Worm. Yep, I'm gonna take nine. Not happy yeah, about you're... that. Yeah, you're gonna take nine. Um, what else do I want to do? This is the quest. You have a low life points, but uh, you have a lot. You have a control deck, so if you roll any floodgates, it could be dangerous. Mm -hmm. Unless I have That's another true. out. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Okay, all right. Very funny. A little bit late, but very funny. Ooh, you got something reactive you can use here. Interesting. Yeah, I need to think about this. What are you thinking about? What are you thinking about? You're playing a lot of control. The Ooh. question is, do I need do to... Do you have like a regeki break or something back there? Do I need Do I need to control the pace oh, a little more? Oh, you have a regeki break. I know you're going to flip that. I don't like set cards in GOAT <laughs> format, so oh, I'm going to send that okay. one sure. back to your hand. Look, no, no flipping on me right now, okay? That's fair. That's fair. Uh, we'll just reset him. And okay. uh, I think I want to do this. We'll, uh, we'll set... We'll set two more. Oh my we'll gosh, pass. two more. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, okay, interesting. Why don't you just use that spear soldier again and just pierce my monster? What are you afraid of? Yeah, this thing's gonna be freaking uh, big shield gardener or something. <laughs> um, that is Joe, Okay, you don't have torrential. You do not. Don't make a stupid face at the camera when you have it, okay? <laughs> you do not have torrential. Oh, Kaiku, yeah, it's fine. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Spear soldier, this thing could definitely pierce through this. I'm and sure that you said not. something. <laughs> no! <laughs> All three! <laughs> You've only drawn eight cards! Do you, you have, have the third out, gates. Ruxin? <laughs> you have three floodgates! Come on! Oh my gosh! Where's Here your, where's your go. oh, no dust tornado this time? Oh, how oh. unfortunate. How oh, unfortunate. I wish I had a side deck. Oh, don't mind if I do. Let's activate oh. one of the best cards in Yu-Gi-Oh! Ooh, so this you can is draw. Fun. What are you gonna draw? Level limit, gravity bind, wall of revealing light number two. You'll find out. You'll find out. I'm definitely getting rid of this blade rabbit. Blade rabbit. Here we go. Here comes Dream Clown. And I think I'm gonna get rid of this blade rabbit while I'm at it. <laughs> okay. All right. Double rabbit. Medusa worm, rise <sighs> from the set position and destroy his kaiku. Oh. Uh, I can't take out your spear soldier, unfortunately. So we're gonna activate this Medusa worm. Just yeah. Get back it. down there. Uh, I'm going to get, get back Blade down Rabbit there. out, though. Sure. And uh, I'm going to just make your life a little bit more miserable in case you do have a monster that can take out Blade Rabbit, but I don't think you do. I'm going to activate Stumbling. Oh, boy. Yeah, Which actually, yeah. I just realized uh, I messed up the sequencing there because I should have Yeah, you should have summoned first. it after. Yeah, I played yeah. this last week. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You I'm going to lose with familiar. it, and then I'm going to lose to it. This is great. <laughs> okay. This is not usually how you would play this, but I appreciate you uh, helping me out a little oh, bit. Oh, shit. <laughs> that would be really good if I didn't have my spell shield type 8 to what? stop you. No, do you have every out? <laughs> this is unbelievable. Oh, my god! I have to protect my cards, Ruxin. I have to protect my cards. You have every out. Well... Uh, I guess it doesn't really matter if he's in attack or defense, <laughs> does it? Oh my god! Perfect, perfect. Oh, heart of the cards, come do. on, baby. All right, I will flip the Medusa worm. Destroy his spear soldier. Great. Unfortunately, yeah. I don't get the damage in here because of uh, <laughs> the yeah, effect get of to my defense. stumbling, which is Thank you, stumbling. very annoying. But we will have to deal with that. Thank uh, you, stumbling. Go, my blade rabbit, attack! <laughs> I can't wait to tell you why this is a particularly annoying uh, deck you're using against me. Do I do this? I might actually. I need to get a clock on you. I basically can stop anything that you summon. I mean, I've got full control of the board, but the more turns I give you, the longer you have to find out. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to summon this morphing jar. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I was thinking about holding off here. I've got to flip the Medusa. Oh, well, that's fine. I gotta um, send Ron Style a text real quick. <laughs> All right, perfect. Yeah, I gotta text him that, what's going on in episode two. All right. You can just send him a picture. <laughs> That's what I did. I sent him a picture of your board. 
Okay. Uh, what, what do I even do? I've got you on full lock right now, buddy. Yeah, this is great. Okay. Go ahead. There better be some good back row. That's very funny. Okay. Something reactive. Interesting. Very interesting. Yes. Yeah, it's all about reactions. Uh, we're going to put everything to attack. Because it's reactive, I know you don't have Mirror 4, so I'm going to just swing in with everything. Okay. Get in some nice Heart damage here. Heart of the cards. Heart of the cards. This is weird. I kind of want to flip the Medusa Worm down, but I actually prefer the damage, because if I do that, then I do less. Blade Rabbit can take <laughs> out whatever. I'm just going to set another back row and pass. Sure. Onus is on you. All right. Heart of the cards, baby. Right here. This is what we need. You just have to draw a heavy storm, right? Um, does that do anything? Okay. All right. All right. Sure. Yeah. Go ahead. Just passing. That's what I like to see. Can I get another good card? That's not bad. Not particularly good right now, but it's okay. Uh, we'll just go battle. Just hit with everything. Do, 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 do. The beatdown oh, has begun. Okay. Oh, yeah. Don't worry. Part of the cards is going to come through for me. Is it? <laughs> yeah, definitely. I'm only doing 1600 damage a turn, so you've got- I had two <laughs> spell and trap outs, by the way. I'm just I'm just throwing that out there. Okay, all right. Two. I had two in the first hand. And it wasn't and I'm enough. Still getting, I'm still getting freaking gravity binded. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, yeah, yeah. All right, I would like another monster so I can at least try to win the game. That is another monster. Unfortunately, let me do some math here. So this is 16. It'll put you down to... What does that put you down? 23? That is lethal next turn. So let's do this. Let's attack with everything. Have you figured out my, uh, my restriction yet? Level twos. You have figured out my restriction. Yes. <laughs> uh, we'll go Makes to sense. second main. We're gonna Honestly, summon some Mask of Darkness. Level twos. Mask of Darkness. Okay, that's a it's a big monster for it you. It is a nine hundred monster, and it does put you at lethal next turn. So I am going to pass here. All right. All right. That may actually be the highest attack monster. In my all tech, right. Now that this is it. it. This is it right here. Okay. Okay. This is where we draw it. Oh, interesting. You have two back rows, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> but uh, I'll summon my tribe infecting virus. Ooh, let's see. So I have two rocks on the field. So that would be good if I didn't have solemn judgment. <laughs> uh, oh, the pain and suffering continues. What? Oh, my gosh. This is where you Soul just heavy storms, right? right? It was all bait all along. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what we do. <laughs> all right, time to thin the deck. This is our only chance. Terraforming? Yeah, that's fine. Or Necro Valley. Okay, so you're just playing. What is your restriction? You have only level four so far. So it could be like, that could be it. All right. That would be a shame, wouldn't it? Well, you've got to do something here, so. Okay. I Hanging imagine on. we're not going to get lethal here. Or are you? We'll find out. Uh, one another more turn. Another compulse. Another compulse. Okay. One sure. more turn. Here's the here's the turn. We turn it all around right here. Sure. Turn it around. I don't even have to summon anything now. Okay. <laughs> this is not the turn we turned it all around. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Gravity vine. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Letting me get the final blow. Honestly, I was I think I, my decision to get rid of that that wall of reeling light was the right decision. I had to go as fast as possible, but I don't yeah, blame you. I don't blame <laughs> you. I don't blame you. All right, you'll get in game two, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, definitely. I'll have a better <laughs> hand this time. All right. I imagine you want to go first this time. Oh, yeah. So I was supposed to go first last time. <laughs> that would have helped a lot against your deck, that, actually. That could have helped. That could have made oh the difference. Oh, my gosh. That would have been huge. I could have actually dusted your stuff. Okay. Ooh. All right. Okay. You might you might be a little bit better off this time. We'll see, though. Okay. That, hopefully. Because it, it otherwise, it's going to be a very quick a very quick video. <laughs> draw, draw me a good card, baby. Come on. Well, see, I thought you would have enjoyed... <laughs> I thought you would have enjoyed me playing this deck because it would make the game go on so long that we'd actually hit ad revenue. Ah, uh, here's the thing. Sometimes <laughs> when you get gravity binded, uh, you get a little lucky on the next turn. That's fine. Uh, That's fine. I got graceful yeah. last game. I can't oh, complain. Oh, baby! 
Oh. He's so happy. <laughs> Baby! Oh, I cannot wait to do this. Are you gonna royal tribute me? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh baby, enjoy oh. your hands. <laughs> Let's go. Got to resolve it. That's Got deserved. That's it. all I'm saying. And graceful. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, this is so deserved. Okay, okay. Sad, sad part is my hand's so good. I gotta discard two good cards. <laughs> um yeah, I'm thinking that's what we're gonna do. You're not out of this yet. I am still playing the stall deck. So yeah, oh, you're never yeah, you're never out of it with your deck. Um, hitting three cards out of my hand is pretty good though. Yeah, hitting three cards, drawing a bunch of cards, I like it. Okay, we'll draw. If I don't win with that, then That's I don't hilarious. even know. Okay. No, you did not draw gravity bind. So I'm gonna activate stumbling. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's annoying. Slow you down a little bit, and then I'm gonna set two and pass. Okay. You knew I had two cards in my hand that were back row. So. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, man. Oh, the longer I wait, the more chance you draw something annoying. That's true. The problem is you have freaking stumbling. But this is, oh, that kind of screws everything. Okay, well, oh, that's a problem. Man, it, the longer you wait, more chance of gravity buying wall of revealing light. All right, okay, I'm going to have to wait one turn. Passing, okay, sure. Oh, not drawing. Interesting. That's funny. I'll just... I'm not in a hurry, honestly. I'm just going to pass. Oh, you're definitely not in a hurry. Eh? Okay, let, let, let's put a little clock on you. Yes, that'll help. That'll help. That'll help. And you are not playing Torrential Tribute in this deck, which you definitely are. But you're not going to draw it. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, okay. Not like you can attack me. I cannot attack you, unfortunately. This turn, anyway. This turn. Next turn, though, when you when you activate Wall of Revealing Light... That is very funny, but I think I'm fine. I'm just gonna pass. Okay, it's time to force you to do something. Is it? Do you, I mean, you might not have to do anything. I, I guess you don't have to. I don't you wanna take to. two. But I, I think wall. you're going to. Yeah, there's the wall, okay. Let's see if you have any response. Uh, I mean, yeah, I'm not, I'm, I'm not letting Whoa! that happen. Oh, yeah. judgment for that? That's crazy. Oh, I mean, yeah. I guess you need to I get mean, it's in. It's four for four. It's four for four if you if you don't do anything. That is fair. That is fair. Yeah, and, and it outs one of them, and I don't have to use one of my back row removals. I, yeah, get that, get that out of here. Okay, the question is, I think that that's fine. Let's do that. All right, th All right. this game, this game, we're losing life points quickly, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going to Pass. set two cards face down. Really? Okay. Really? You're going to set two cards face down? Shocking, I know. Oh my gosh. Two cards face down. Wow. Man, no monsters so Well, I guess I did get rid of three monsters. That's zero. <laughs> you did that get rid of three sense. monsters. I did get rid of three of your monsters. That checks out. Okay. Let us make you use something else. The last time you didn't use your other card, but you have two set cards. You're probably saving Saku or Mirror Forest or something. Or another wall of revealing light, which would be really annoying. Okay. Okay. You either have your toggle off or those can't do anything. <laughs> um, I'm guessing toggle off. Uh, okay, go ahead. You're at 2k. It's getting precarious. No wall. No more walls. No more walls. I mean, you could 1500 and hope you get rid of Necro Valley. I guess that could happen. I'm going to set a card after 10,000 years and pass the turn. <laughs> Royal Tribute, let's go. All right, the time is now. Heavy. Do you have your own solemn this. judgment? I do. You do have a I solemn judgment. It for just this occasion. Do you I have a second solemn judgment? Oh, oh, we might actually just be dead here then. You may or may not. No uh -oh. to your no. Heavy storm. I drew this turn one as well. <laughs> that's insane. That's a crazy <laughs> hand if you drew that turn one. It was okay. all graceful. And yeah. uh, yes, you are in fact dead. As the guard too. Shit. Yeah, you got yeah. this one. Okay, right. well played. Well played. Okay, yeah. Pop we had graceful the, royal tribute. Heavy we had storm the best turn one. possible hand. I was about to say. I I don't know how I was beating that. Maybe I should have judgmented your judgment on the wall. Uh, but you had heavy anyway, so it actually wouldn't have mattered. Yeah, I was just holding heavy because, like, <laughs> I knew you had something. So. 
All right, all important game three, and thankfully I get to go first, so that is a huge edge for me. Yeah, unfortunately, when I uh, you know flipped going first, the game wasn't working. So it, see, the game just didn't want you to have <laughs> the 24 hours of anti woodcutting. So here we are. Here yeah, we are. honestly, the game's doing me a favor. I can't really complain. <laughs> Well, we'll have to see. My hand needs to be good enough to actually withstand all your removal. So we'll see. That's the luck, buddy. I'm glad I did plan for this happening potentially, and I do have a lot of removal. So, okay. but you have a lot of cards. So I it's have hard a to lot of stuff. So it's going to be yeah. a matter of if we can actually resolve our win condition. Okay. So we're going to go set one. We are going to activate. How do I want to play this? I've seen a lot of stuff out of your deck. Mm -hmm. I'm going to activate Messenger of Peace. Oh, there's even more! Oh, I'm going to set one and I'm going to pass. <laughs> oh, what is this? 1,500 or less? Okay, okay. Or more. If more can attack. Yeah, so I have to have 1,400. Oh my gosh, you have so much. That was the idea. Yeah, that's... that's. Which, I, I don't know if you figured out my deck restriction yet. I don't think uh, I... I mean, I've seen a bunch of level fours. That, I mean, you're playing a bunch of Grave Keepers, too. So I'm not sure yeah. if there's like some weird restriction with that on the wheel. Yeah, right. I did have a lot of options on there. <laughs> Next time there's going to be like 30 and then it's going to be like 100 options at some point. Just keep adding to it. I hate the, I hate your sets. They're all scary. <laughs> level twos have some good sets, actually. They do. Uh, there's a lot of good level two set monsters. There's a lot of good level twos. So some I'm just me... you may not have even seen yet. I, I probably haven't, honestly. I've, I've seen Blade Rabbit, Medusa Worm, Mask of Darkness, Morphing Jaw. Morphing jar. Oh my gosh, please. Uh, and speaking of morphing jar, let's just play some of this stuff. <laughs> sure. Okay, what? Well, it's probably a Medusa worm, but it could be something else. I, until I know what it is, I kind of. I kind of just have to. Man. 1500 on Gravekeepers is pretty rough. <laughs> well, especially when you just activated Necro Valley. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Well, they're 1500 anyway, so whatever. That's but true. Yeah. Not all of um, them. All yeah, that's that's true. I guess the smaller ones I just pumped up. What? A, oh man, that's pretty pretty bad at this point. I'm gonna set. Okay. I'm gonna set a couple. Okay. Uh, Ooh. Yeah, or three. I guess more than a couple. You're really afraid of morphing jar. Yeah, just in case. It's fair. All right. We're definitely paying the maintenance cost. The here. stupidest maintenance cost <laughs> ever made. How is 100 an appropriate maintenance cost? Because old Yu-Gi-Oh is great. All right, it's time to show you the actual win condition of this deck that you have not seen this entire time. I flip Needle Worm. Oh no, this is a mill deck. <laughs> oh, those all sucked totally, anyway. Thank you. Yeah, I was gonna say we didn't hit anything good. I'm <laughs> yeah. trying to hit like all your spell and trap removal. Yeah, so yeah, that that's. Sucks. That's actually not the worst, but the All problem right. is five cards is very a much quicker win condition than 100 life points. Very true. I will set two more cards and throw it back to you. Oh, boy. Okay. You have Needle Worm. You've got something reactive, too, to my Needle Worm flipping, so I definitely think you have a judgment back there. I think I think at, at some point I got to get going. I, I got to I can't be I can't be milled out. I'm sure you got another card, but we're going to find out anyway. Hmm. I'm going to judge uh, with that. That's fine. I can go. Would you like to? You don't want a judgment, okay? Sounds good. That's fine. Um, I guess I'm gonna I'm gonna find out what you have. Sure. My spear soldier is here. I don't think he's gonna last too long. Um, the question is, do I hit this needle worm? The flip is pretty dangerous. I'm probably more scared of that, so I'm gonna attack this. Oh, Ruxin. Oh, oh no. Ruxin. You thought you were going to get in. But yeah, we have the yeah, wall. Yeah, yeah, okay. Pay your 2,000. It's as good as an attack, I guess, for now. Okay, yeah, that's a problem. Uh, yeah. ooh, ooh, this could get this could get dangerous. It could. Could get dangerous. Okay, man. Needle worm. What if that's another needle worm? I have 27 cards. I mean, it takes five more needle worms, basically. Ooh, needle worm, needle worm. Is that the TP3 version, by the way? Of course. Why, why would okay. I play anything wow, less? Wow, dude, you're playing an expensive deck for this video. <laughs> I appreciate it. Okay. I did actually have to spend quite a few gems to uh, get the components for this deck, I will admit. It's probably just a Medusa worm, which is not a just. That's, that's scary. <laughs> I was um, going to say just a Medusa worm? Uh, I don't know, buddy. Yeah, I don't know about just, but okay, I'm going to end. 
Play back to Alex. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. Okay. Medusa oh, worm. Oh, is it compulse? Maybe it is compulse. I think I think I think I'm gonna do it. Just in case to save one of my okay. cards. Sure. Maybe I misread when this first needle worm flipped here. Well, I'm not in like a huge hurry right now. Not yet. Let us I'm just gonna set. Okay. I'll put the worm to defense just so I don't. I guess I should have kept it in attack because your spear soldier can pierce. So yeah, yeah, you know, I'd do more damage. Um, man, wall of revealing light. That is a card. That is definitely a card. I was gonna say. I feel like as soon as you didn't judgment wall, I probably could have guessed that that wasn't judgment. Yeah, judgmenting wall would have been nice. Oh, it was such a hard decision. I, I think, I think I need to put, I need to put, I need to put the screws on you. Going for it. Okay. Do you sure. have your own judgment? I don't. Okay. Okay. Spell shield. Wait. Whoa. Spell shield. You don't have a spell card in your hand, I guess. That gives away some information. Otherwise, I 100% would have. Because that definitely uh, would have been activated. That's true. Okay. That's true. Okay. Yeah. I def yeah. That makes sense. All right. Tribe it up. Oh, wow. You are going for it. Book is the last card. Book's not really doing much against me, to be fair. No, <laughs> it is absolutely not. Oh, you're getting in. Okay. Yeah. Let's do as much damage as possible. I have a feeling you have a trap card in your hand. That's going to do something. Okay, Milne, yeah. Here's your dust tornado. Dust, that sucks. Okay, let's do as much as we can. I have, a feeling, I have a feeling I'm going to be stopped short here. I need I need to do as much damage as possible. At least you can no longer activate wall for 2k. Understandably. So That's there's like, that. The fact that you got that under the threshold is so good for you. Yeah, and the problem is I had to destroy my own Necro Valley or you'd have like 900 right now. <laughs> that is true. That is true. I should have held that, honestly. All right, we prepared for just such an occasion here. So we're I gonna figured go you did. Set, and we're going to set, and we're going to pass. Yeah, yeah, gravity bind. Here it is. Huh. I wish Gravekeeper's Assailant could flip face downs. That'd be nice. Yeah, uh, if only that card was better. Okay, um, I'm sure I'm going to be stopped here. Okay, wait a second. I don't remember seeing you... Have a chance to activate this. This definitely could be Mirror Force. Now I wish I'd switched one to defense. I mean, you don't have to attack me if you're worried. Look, if it's Mirror Force, it's Mirror Force. <laughs> I have to attack. And it's probably Mirror Force. I should have switched <laughs> Assailant to defense. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to mind game myself. I'm attacking. Oh. Okay. Oh, thanks for the five cards. You have nothing left? You got it, buddy. You got it. <laughs> oh, God, I cannot yes. believe you got me right under the threshold. It was another wall of revealing light. No so, way. That, yep, okay, good, it was good right decision. Under. It was right oh, under. Oh, wow. You got it. That, it really was going to boil down to if uh, if you had heavy or if I had to wait to negate heavy, I feel right. like. Yeah, I, I was suspicious that that was a judgment, so it, thank goodness it wasn't. But I was like, look, if I sit any longer and he draws something, I'm just screwed. Like, I have to, yeah. you got rid of my dust tornado. So I, I think I had two dust, because I think that's the limit, and then one MST, heavy storm, and then maybe like one other card for back row. So it was sure, like, I only had sure. two more chances. So I kind of had to go for it. Yeah, yeah. And so like I had the jar in my hand too and I was debating on what to set. I didn't think you were good. I didn't think you had heavy at that point. So I'm like, okay. Yeah. Cause like the wall stuck around. So then you went heavy, summon a bunch of guys. And especially cause one of them was tribe. Tribe just popped a thing. So you were able to get like mega aggressive against me. Yeah. I was not expecting like that one, two punch to come out of nowhere. So I was holding on to that second wall in case you outed the first one, which, funny enough, you did. And I had plenty <laughs> of spells in my deck. I'm actually playing, what is this, 9, 12, 15, Oh, that 70. would have been huge if I'm you had a spell. I'm playing 17 spells for the spell shield, and I just didn't have an extra spell in hand, unfortunately. Yeah. So I couldn't. I didn't have a way to negate your heavy, which was unfortunate. But Yeah, I was I was holding yeah. the heavy to make sure I could do a at least a bunch of damage. And then I, I either drew tribe or book. I don't remember. I think I drew tribe. So I was oh, like, because okay. when you switch it to defense, I was like, that actually sucks I was planning on attacking your set and right. then attacking over the needle, but you switch it and then I drew tribe and I was like, oh, I can out this. So I can at least like do a bunch, like get you down under 2000. Yeah, and book's so, not doing anything for you anyway. And, oh, it's uh, terrible. I did, yeah, it I, does do, nothing. I did play mirror force. So it's funny you thought about that. Um, I didn't play torrential, but I was on the mirror. Well, force, oh, oh yeah, what was set? It was just a second wall of revealing light. Oh, so, oh yeah, yeah, wall of revealing yeah. light, right. Yeah, okay, because yeah. I was like, 
I was like, oh my gosh, I, I should have, which if I had played around it, I guess I still would have won, but if I just switched one, but I was like, yeah. oh, I'm playing right into it. But if, if this it was happens. like any other circumstance where you went heavy and didn't have tribe, you would have only gotten in with like one of your monsters yeah. because the spear soldier would have still pierced. You would have hit for like yeah. maybe 16 to 18, but I still would have had enough to wall on the next turn. You would so have been 35 ish, something yeah. like that. Exactly. Yeah. So then I could have reestablished control at that point. I also had Blade Rabbit, so maybe I should have been like a bit more aggressive sending that out to start like clearing your board a bit instead of just sending yeah. the worm. But my priority was to make you get rid of your spell and trap removal. So then like I just win the game because if if you lose your heavy storm or anything, it's over. All right. Well, Simo, uh, no wood cutting for you. Baby. No wood cutting Let's for me. Go! No wood cutting for me. I better get started right now. I gotta yep. I gotta get going. <laughs> so you got it till 11:41 a.m. tomorrow. <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds good. I am a man of my word all right well this has been fun it's always fun having you on the channel and vice versa thanks so for thanks me. for coming on of course congrats on the win go check him out of course yeah yep. he is uh he is making many more cool series such as mascus which is somehow over a year old like <laughs> how insane. is that even possible i don't even know i don't even know yeah so that that's pretty nuts and, and like i saw that and i was like how is how is that possible the time is flying time yep time doesn't exist doesn't it doesn't exist. exist, except for 24 hours of no wood cutting for you. Shout out to Tom Fo Show, Ernesto Deanna, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Brandon Cheney, Ian Musa Jr. Barding, Robert F. Cheng Lang, and Adelso Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.